Hello dear viewers, Assalamu alaikum. I am Engineer Muhammad Reza Ulha. Welcome to my Automation Tools YouTube channel. We know in industrial system, different types of online analyzer are using to measure the different sample of gases. Conductivity analyzer or transmitter is most usable one of them to determine the conductivity of our process condensate or our demi plant, demi water or the process water. Today, I will discuss about the configuration and language changing procedure of conductivity liquid line MCM42 model analyzer or transmitter. So, let's start. First, we change the language of this transmitter. That is the, you see, this is the analyzer connectivity analyzer transmitter. And uh, we first we change the English language, sorry, Chinese language to English language. So we go to the last menu and then go to fresh this button. Then if you see the English language, press the English. Then you see the transmitter language will be changed to the English mode. That is why it, before it was the Chinese mode, Chinese language. Now it is showing the English language. It is the display mode. Now I will show the different uh, parameter of this transmitter. It is the so, we go to the, it is the measuring mode, in the measuring mode you can see the measuring setup, diagnostic, uh, calibration, different uh, option are showing is here. When you press the enter button, that is the right side button, uh, then you press the enter, you go to the measurement mode. You see, it is the measurement mode. In the measurement mode, different types of uh, display showing that you see when you press the showing another one, all value is showing the big, the big display value, it is changing. Just only you press the inter button in the right uh, side corner knob, then the display value is changing. That it is the showing the temperature, uh, say conductivity and temperature and conductivity raw value will all also be showing like that. For that, you in the calibration mode, when you press the calibration button here, you can see the different parameter of calibration, setting value, the reference value, and then the uh, other parameter is showing is here. When you want to configure the, when the calibration, the sensor of this uh, conductivity sensor, then we have to be use the uh, standard solution, the conductivity. That is, you see, here the transmitter is calibrated by uh, the reference value, you see, 49.31 micro siemens per centimeter. That means the solution was used to calibrate this uh, transmitter or the sensor. This type, uh, this uh, solution of conductivity was uh, 49.31 micro siemens per uh, centimeter. If you want to recalibrate this uh, transmitter, then you have to be, uh, first you have to be take the uh, standard solution. Uh, the solution that will know the conductivity of this transmitter, then you can calibrate this transmitter. Our transmitter is already calibrated, so we don't calibrate. I am showing the different parameter. How can you do that? There? You see, then we can go to the another mode. It is, uh, you see, again we go to the display mode, then we go to the operating mode, of, and in the right hand side, you can. Do uh, rotate the knob and press the enter button, then you can go to the uh, different types of menu. You see the operating mode, major value is showing the conductivity. When you, you see, it is, it is the conductivity transmitter, so we select conductivity. This transmitter you also can use for the uh, uh, different types of uh, uh, conductivity PS, you can use the other. Then you go to the current output, uh, it is the current output is showing that the, it is a linear transmitter in the report. You see that is a linear, you see, major value, say overall value, you see, main value, linear, it is a linear mode, and I see the upper value and the lower value. The upper value is the maximum, which uh, uh, maximum value that you want to measure, and the lower value is uh, almost uh, taking it is zero, and uh, you can change the upper value to measure the different uh, ranges value or the calibrated value. It is now our transmitter is also showing the value is the uh, 0 to 20. Now I change it to 0 to 40. Then you, after changing, you can press the enter button. In, uh, only the, when you select the cell, the knob is rotated and uh, press the middle position of this right side knob, then you can uh, change the, then you can go to the edit code and you can change the different value of this uh, transmitter. You see, select setup value, you can go to the setup, you can measure value, you can see, you see our transmitter uh, 
value change before it was showing 40, so now it also shows 40. That means the uh, already it is showing the maximum value. Now we you see in the display value go to the setup mode. Now again we show the changing parameters or configuration. You see go to the current output again you can go to current output and we want to change the range value from to the 90 or the 40 range here. You see it is the, the most important configuration setting of this transmitter is the first one is the select the sensor parameter that means the conductivity piece or the diode transmitter. Then you can set the upper value and lower value of this transmitter and another important option is that the to calibration the calibrate the transmitter or the calibration of the sensor. It is the three most element three, three, it is the three element that you need, need to the configure of this transmitter. If you configure this if three element is correctly then the you can get the value of this transmitter is work uh, properly. That means again I am saying first one is the select the transmitter which one where, which one we are using it is the conductivity or pH or oxygen or diode transmitter. That means the liquid line EMC 442 model in the household household model uh, transmitter, it can use for the PS meter conductivity and other oxygen analyzer. So, first you have to be select this one, then you have to the transmitter linearity, this is the linear transmitter or the square root transmitter, then you have to select this one, then we have to be configured so that we calibrate the transmitter as per the standard solution or standard sample. Then, if you can dump this in three works in properly, then you can, uh, then the transmitter will be works properly and it is showing the accurate value as per your uh, sample. You see, it is a display value. After I change this your the 0 to 40, then I changing it the analog output value is 0 to 48. I change this value because before it was configured as a 0 to 40 series, but our the process condensate conductivity is increasing. And for that, in the DC system, we cannot see the value of this transmitter because the analog output range is 0 to 20 by microsiemens per centimeter square. Centimeter. But the, our range already gone to the 40. So we change this the analog output value to 0 to 80. For that, we can see. Then for that the transmitter will be transmitted the value to the DC system or the master controller system. That then then we can see the value of this transmitter. It is a simple transmitter. It is in you no know, not is the difficult. You see, it is the different types of parameter is showing that when you install you can set the uh, installation date, time. Because also you can set the alarm value. That uh, you can set the alarm value for that uh, when the alarm value is come, then the transmitter will give in the alarm. You see, it is the alarm message. You can see the only the milliampere value. You can set the milliampere value. Then we know the 0 to 4 to 20 milliampere. If you set the 2 milliampere, this will be 50. When the first value is come, you will get the alarm. And the, uh, if you see the 20 milliampere, then the, you can see the alarm value as well. When the output value becomes 20, then you can give an alarm. So, you can see the also you get to go to the diagnostic mode to see in the diagnostic mode you can see the different uh, error of this transmitter that is already are showing in this transmitter by showing this uh, uh, diagnostic error you can take the action the what the happening in the transmitter and why it does not is showing the value in properly so dear friend in this video, I shall try to show you the different option of this uh, conductivity transmitter liquid line EMCM4200 and uh, the setting position of this transmitter. If you think this my video is very helpful for you, please subscribe my channel. If you already subscribe, thank you. So, please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. Also, like, comments, and share. Thanks for watching.